Hello, I am Professor Jim Bolonium, and we have just found out that if you do not have the MMR vaccine, you end up with MMR, mumps, measles, and rubellas, like my young friend over here. As you can see, he has measles, and the male version of mumps. We do not feel the symptoms of the female version yet, but it will probably be around. We are, we are assuming it will be swollen chin. Now, measles, you will know they're pretty much like spots. Mumps, you get the swollen, you know where. And rubellas are a German type of measles. Now, if you do not have the MMR vaccine, you will end up like my friend over here, who, as you can see, is extremely ill with his measles and gagging everything. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's okay, it's okay. But, like me, I did have the MMR vaccine. I did have grow a bit of facial hair from it, but that's okay with me. But I, ha I have eczema, so I decided to have it as I have a weaker immune system than my young friend over here. Which is partly why he didn't have the vaccine, as he thought his immune system was strong enough to cope. But it shows up that it wasn't. But I am fine, as my immune system now knows how to fight this disease. Uh, join us next week for our uh, uh, continue to the show, and we will try to find out some more things. I'll pass it over to my uh, diseased friend. If I were you, I'd really take the vaccine. May give you eczema or autism, but oh, but. Welcome back to the show, and we have some breaking news. Three days after he got the uh, M uh, measles, mumps, and rubellas, we found out a new symptom. Xbox, Xbox angitis. Symptom being addicted to the Xbox for 24-7 and non-stop playing. As you can see, he is extremely addicted and he can play without even looking at the screen. And his Im as, as it went on, his immune system got slowly destroyed and now he is able to teleport without even meaning to. He's not even trying yet. We found these problems out just a few minutes ago as he decided that he told us he hadn't stopped playing the Xbox for over three days. And that is when he got his MMR vaccine. No, his MMR disease, sorry. Uh, yes. He is very, very, very ill with his Xbox enchitis and his measles. Mumps. And rubellas. <laughs> as you can see, he's not entirely as sick. As you can see, he, he got a smile out of him there. All through his game. As you see, if he plays his game well, he, he becomes happy. But he's still got his measles there going on. Yes. Uh, I'm only happy because of the game. If it wasn't for this, I'd be really sad. Okay. So, we are, we are, we are just saying to everyone out there, go get the MMR vaccine. And as you can see, I am I am losing a bit of my facial hair here. It's 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 disappearing. It does help that I'm shaving a bit, but okay. Um yes, so do g go get the MMR vaccine if you're under six. I killed him. <laughs> Thank you. Goodbye. Welcome back, and as you can see, I've lost all my facial hair after my injection, but there was one bad thing about having the injection. I was one of the unlucky unlucky people, and I ended up getting a few fits and seizures about a week to two weeks after, but we have more breaking news. My young friend over here, as you can see, his mumps are going, but his measles, well, they're still there. I still have terrible headaches and muscle pain, and, I, and I've kind of lost my appetite. I don't want to eat much. Anymore. Yes, we found out that a new, uh, new symptom for mumps is that he can have headaches. You can have muscle aches, and you lose your appetite. Now, I like this person here. He still has his Xbox angitis, but as you can see, he's obviously doing well in his game as he is smiling. But um, he he doesn't like to eat. I think the only thing he's eaten in about three days is a couple of sandwiches. A couple of sandwiches. What did you have in those sandwiches, young young Fred? Ham. I think ice cream. Ham and ice cream sandwiches. No, not ice cream sandwiches. Okay, just ham and ice cream on its own. So uh uh this brings us to the end of our 
are, ex are exploring into NMR. So, after this, I would say go get the vaccine. But what would young Fred say? Definitely. Much, much easier. Much better for you. Much easier. You don't have to go through the torture that my friend went through. But We're not friends. Okay. So, what would you say the best, the worst thing about getting uh, Emma, measles, mumps, and rubella is? The pimples and the mumps. The mumps is the worst. I know this is a hard question, but would you say the best thing is? Xbox and Jaggers, probably. I'm not surprised you have, you have been playing that Xbox for two weeks straight now. Well, uh, thanks for watching and we'll see you later. Bye.